biting wind and choppy waters as the European winter sets in. These boats almost didn't make it. After a perilous journey across the Aegean Sea, the refugees on board arrive on the Greek island of Lesbos. Uh, there were three boats coming. They were already very low in the water. I guess they were sinking and they were getting in by, by a fishing boat in the harbour. Nearby along the shore, crews remove several bodies that washed up overnight. They're grim reminders of exactly what's at stake for those trying to escape the conflict at home. Europe is struggling to cope with this refugee crisis. Many hope to reach Germany, which has opened its doors to them. Uh, I have uh, many friends uh, went there. Uh, there's some relatives uh, uh, also went there. And they always tell us uh, the good, uh, good people, uh, good services. To get there, they have to pass through several Eastern European countries. Croatia wants to speed up the process of registering those crossing its border. The government is set to unveil a new winter camp in Slavonski Broad this week. This is a place which is now totally equipped with everything what we need from uh, uh, showers, tents, uh, heated uh, tents, uh, containers for uh, vulnerable groups and we are not expecting problems on this position. Capacity is uh, 5,000 people in one moment. From Croatia, these people will most likely go north to Slovenia and then Austria before reaching Germany. At each stop, they face yet more difficulties. For the countries, the issue is numbers. More than double they faced than previous years. For the refugees, it's about doing whatever it takes for a chance at a new life. Gerald Tan, Al Jazeera.